Hey guys, so, uh, today I'm gonna make a I'm gonna do a little quick video of this product that I bought to clean my truck, and uh, supposedly it's called uh, it's, it. You don't have to brush it or scrub it or nothing. You just spray it on the truck and then let it sit and then pressure wash it off, and then it cleans your truck. Uh, I've used this stuff. I just bought a five gallon bucket of it uh two weeks ago from uh napa auto parts some napa stores carry it um you could i also found this stuff on ebay from a company called zorro who sells it on ebay for 30 35 or 40 dollars for five gallon um they only charge five dollars shipping from zorro um if, if the order is below uh, I think fifty dollars or less. You pay five dollars if it's over, over fifty dollars, and you get free shipping. But uh, this stuff's called Zip Truck and Trailer Wash, and this stuff works. It's pretty amazing how well this stuff works. It's about as I have never found a product that you don't have to scrub the truck or anything to get all the crap off of it, all the road uh, film and mud and bugs and everything. This stuff right here does it. It works. Um, I bought one of these uh, foam cannon lances off of uh, Amazon for, I think it was like 15 or $20. Um, I put this stuff straight out of the, the five-gallon bucket into this uh, foam cannon. I don't dilute it with nothing. I let the machine do the diluting for it. Uh, it leaves a nice soapy uh, uh, covering on the truck. And uh, as you can tell, this truck's pretty dirty. It's rained a couple of days ago and got a lot of road grime and mud on it. And uh, I think there's even some bugs and stuff on the front right here. But uh, I'm gonna spray it down with this stuff and let it sit for three or four minutes or so. And I'm not gonna let it dry, but uh, I'm gonna let it sit and soak, soak for a second, a few minutes. And we're going to pressure wash it off, and I'll show you guys the result uh, the best I can. But uh, give me a second, I'm going to get this hooked up, and we'll be right back. Okay, guys, we got it all hooked up here. We're going to spray this stuff on, like so. This is on a dry truck. I had, I didn't pre-soak it or nothing. I sprayed it directly on a dry truck. Hard to do this with uh, one hand here, but anyway, as I got this thing adjusted all the way, uh, it's much. Golly, hang on. I got it adjusted all the way so. Soap, maximum soap comes out of the uh, canister. I mean, I only used up about an eighth of a bottle just then, spraying this stuff on. I mean, it's already eating away. It's a lot of that mud, it was caked up right there. You don't want this stuff to dry on your windows or nothing, or it leaves a uh, film if you let it dry. I'm out in the sun. Unfortunately, I'm out in the sun, so I'm gonna have to put another coat on that driver's side there to keep it from drying. We'll do that. We'll probably just coat the whole truck twice with it. And then uh, we'll let it sit for a minute or two. And then we'll switch nozzles out 
and then we'll hose it off and see what kind of results we get out of it. But again, this is no scrubbing, no, no scrubbing required. Let's see. Windows trying to dry on me. Cut this off. Too dang I'm loud. But uh we got a good nice coating, thick coating of soap. Uh and as you can see I didn't get it on this back part right here. Or I didn't get it on the uh, bed of the truck. But uh, I'm gonna do that later. But this is just an example on paint, painted surface of this truck here. It's uh, trying to show how well this stuff works, but uh, I'm pretty impressed with this stuff. I can't. Let's see. You don't have to let it sit for too long. I'm probably fitting to hit it with the uh, with the high pressure. Here in a second. Okay, so I got my new uh, nozzle swapped out here, and uh, we're we're getting pretty close to uh, spraying this off. Uh, let me go ahead and fire this pressure washer up and show you guys what I'm talking about. these bugs off this front right here. Chrome pieces. Look at that. Bugs. Can't tell 
the truck's still wet. Let me shut this off. Can't tell but too much yet because the truck is still wet, but that thing's about as clean as it's gonna get as if you used with a, a scrub brush. There ain't no road grime, nothing on it. I mean, I'm gonna wait. I'm, I'm gonna finish cleaning this thing off real quick and I'm gonna let it dry in the sun this side at least, get it dry. And then um, that'll wrap this video up. Hang on just a second. Let me uh, finish spraying this soap off of this passenger side. All right, guys. So this driver's side is uh, getting pretty dry now. Um, as you can tell, this thing is pretty clean. Um, and you, you can go, go back to the first part of the video and see uh, how dirty it was when we started. Um, and what we got now. Uh, the key, again, the key is to get all that soap off and get it all off before it dries. Because with that foam cannon, it puts a lot of soap on there all in all, all the crevices. And it takes a lot of pressure washing to get that close range pressure washing to get all that soap off of the truck. But, um... Yeah, we're we're pretty good. We don't have any uh, any kind of dirt or nothing on our on our hands coming off of the truck. Around to the front here, all the bugs are gone. See, okay, right here's a little spot. I didn't get all the soap off right here, so it leaves a little bit of a, a film if you don't get it all off. That's the biggest thing is to get it all pressure washed off the soap. But uh, no bugs, no dirt, no road grime, no scrubbing. <laughs> I mean, it's good. This is good product, guys. I mean, this is. I didn't think there was nothing that existed like this stuff out there, but evidently there is. Uh, I'm gonna finish cleaning up the bed of this truck and stuff here in a minute, but. I figured I'd make this video out because I haven't seen a video of this uh, this Zep stuff out there yet. Truck and trailer wash is by uh, Zep. Um, they do make this stuff. You can buy it in a gallon jug also if you don't want to buy five gallons of it. Um, I think a gallon is like $13 or $15 um, for what I've seen it for on uh, on eBay. But... Um, for 35 or $40, you can just go and get five gallons and it'll last you a couple years or a year or two or whatever. It depends how much you wash. But uh, you can use this stuff. I've, I use it on my side-by-side, -side, my four-wheelers, uh, you name it. I lawnmower, I use that stuff on everything. And it it gets, uh, I haven't found another product that gets, uh, gets stuff as clean as that stuff right there does. But uh, anyways, guys, y'all have a good one and we'll see you next time.